Today we are making a delicious 70% flooded cow black forest. Stay tuned for more wonderfully delicious delights. Not everything's like those pastry shows. Hi, I'm Kuji. I'm 32 this year and I'm a pastry chef. I believe uh, most pastry chefs, we need to come up with like, a lot of new, interesting menu, educate our staff with good hygiene. Wow. Each weighing of ingredients is very important because there's actually like, a lot of science towards pastry, so we need to read up quite a lot to like, handle more of the technical items. Besides being creative, it's actually a very physical work itself. We do need to carry like sugar that comes in 10 kg bags, flour that come in 25 kg bags. At the start of the day, I'll do the production. Production consists of making of the cream, making of the insert, and assembling the cakes or tarts. We'll have a lunch break. We'll do R and D. I'll get inspiration from my staff, the social media. We'll do like a service when it's busy. The production team will help the service team wrapping off the counter, topping up and also serving the customer. We also need to do like ordering for the next day, like grocery shopping. After we finish the all-day service, we'll do a massive cleaning of the kitchen with soap and water, wiped down and sanitized fully. Anything else? Okay, yeah. In the pastry industry, there's actually different ranks. We start off with commis 3, which is the lowest rank, commis 2, followed by commis 1, followed by a chef, the party, junior sous chef, sous chef, and pastry chef. There's even more higher positions, but it's normally found in the hotel industry instead. My education pathway is uh, from studying pharmaceutical science in Bali. I actually did my uh, work rotation inside a hospital. Nani? But I didn't want it to be my last job. I think pastry is closest to what I desire. I did my studies in a local baking pastry academy. It's only around one and a half year compared to a four to five year studying in a uni. I started with my internship in a local French bakery. I feel it's not enough creativity for me over there anymore. So I moved on to the hotel industry instead. I actually carried on my passion over there for close to five years before I started my new place over here. It actually came as an opportunity for us. So me and my business partner, Rachel, we decided that it's time to start something up. That's how Pura came about. What people see online, maybe pastry is a very easy thing, but it actually requires a lot of knowledge and experience. We need to increase and cut down our recipes very precisely. Any damage error will lead to a big mistake in the baking. Attitude is very, very important. No matter how harsh the chef score you, just don't take it too personally. We always teach our staff to be nice to all customers. They also have to be very firm at the same time when they are right. This industry is very rough. You must take a lot of things, like with a pinch of salt. Just persevere, be adventurous and be creative.